what's up YouTube this is Madcock83 and guess what I saw today I got onto Facebook and saw that Buildcraft has been ported to Minecraft 1.0 which means it's finally out for 1.0 so let's go ahead and install this uh, just so you know first this video is going to be going up on my channel and my not my new channel but the channel I'm a part of now the Xeno Gamers so let me do a quick plug real quick Please go over there and check it out. Subscribe. Uh, me and the guys over there are putting up a lot of different videos. Uh, we're working on it. We're getting a server together. Once that's together and updated to 1.0, uh, we'll be playing that. And I, after that's all set up, I'll be getting back to doing more mods and trying to catch my mod pack up to 1.0 just as soon as everything's released. All right. So enough of the plugs. Well, let's get started with this one. First thing you want to do, open up your Minecraft. Options, force update, done, login. And besides Buildcraft, I'm going to be installing a couple other ones, uh, single player commands and, and too many items. Uh, once that gets to the Mojang screen, you can cut it off. <coughs> open up your .minecraft folder. So I've created a shortcut here, which I can't believe I never thought of that before. So if you hit percent app data percent like you'd normally get to it, or if you go through run, once you see this Minecraft folder, just right click it and hit create. Create shortcut and take that and drag it to your desktop. I'm going to do it, I've already done it. And you can simply get to that folder a lot easier now. Open up your, now to install it, open up your bin. Open up Minecraft jar with WinRAR. Get over the meta inf. Delete that bad boy out. And I will put links in the description for all these. But here's the start of my mod pack for 1.0. Uh, first thing we're going to do is put too many items. And I'm sorry for the messy desktop. I've been going through a lot of stuff lately and haven't been deleting it like I should. Go ahead and throw that one in there. Single player commands. Get under this world edit jar. And put those in there. Okay. And I've already got it in here from the last time I did it. But what you want to do is take this world edit jar, drag it and drop it into the folder that has your minecraft.jar in it. And after that one, I'm going to put this mini-map in there just for the heck of it. It's a nice little mod. All it does is put a little, a little map in the right top hand corner of your Minecraft. That's all you have to do with that one. Um, I'm going to get the new mod loader. Like I said, I'll put links for all these in the description. Drop it in there. And start up your Minecraft after this one. And too many items and mod loader will generate you a mod folder which you can make yourself, but I just like mine I like the mod to do it for me. It makes, you know, less of an error that I can make. Once you get to the Minecraft screen, just close it out. Uh, you're gonna <coughs> you're gonna uh, put in mod loader MP, not MP server like I did the first time I messed it up. The links on the page are really close together, so I'll just give you the link. Go ahead and drop it in there. We're going to put where's it at? Minecraft Forge client. Grab all these, including that Forge folder up there, and drop that in there. Okay, close that out. You close out your Minecraft.jar. Go back to your .minecraft folder. And you should have a mods folder now. Click on mods, and this is where you're going to put your build craft. You can highlight all of them and drag them over. Uh, for my purposes, I'm going to copy and paste. And just a little hint, this one right here, where to go, where to go, where to go, well this says energy. You don't have to add that one for this one to work. You don't have to add it for any of them to work, any versions of it. That's the part that gives you the engines. Uh, and if you don't add this, you don't get engines, but you can power your quarries and other things with 
bursts of redstone. A constant redstone supply won't work, but a little burst will, which I'll show you in a second. Now that everything is installed, you can close everything out. into your Minecraft. You, if you didn't get a black screen, you did everything right. Let's just go into a world. I believe this is our start of our server world. Oh, where I was playing around a minute ago. Yes. And there we have it, build craft in 1.0. And now it's raining. Oh. And to make sure that you have it, you'll have too many items in there as well. Let's check some of these settings. I'm going to better rendering. Um, this is too many items. If you don't know what it is, it's a great little feature. You can change it to sunrise. They added all this for 1.0. It's great. Uh, this will turn rain off. Uh, if you click this, it's creative. Single player commands does this too, but this one's just a simple push of a button. And if you pick delete mode, you just go through and click whatever you don't want, and it disappears. Here's too many items list and if you did it right there's all your yeah, 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 yeah. Right here. there's all your stuff there's all your build craft stuff and this is there's your map of course default so they're set to X if you type M that's your that controls your little map you do your little key figure and I like to just change these to random ones. And that's a little cobblestone generator. But as you can see, Bill Crafts in here. This is what I mean. If you pulse it like so, you don't require an engine to make this one work. It will just go on its own. Um, and there you have it. Please, uh, Please, if you're watching this on my channel, go over to the Xeno Gamers, give us a uh, like and a, a subscribe. We got a lot of things coming out. You know, I want to get some views on some of our videos. Uh, and also, if you're playing on 1.0 and you want to go back to 1.8, because some of your favorite mods are not updated yet, I got a video on the Xeno Gamers Minecraft how to downgrade or backdate to 1.8.1. Check it out if that helps you. Uh, this is Madcock83. Have a good day.